Hello pack members, it's your girl Alpha Wolf here and I am excited to say that Chook and Sausage Walk the Plank is finally out. Now I am really, really excited to play this game, not only because I've enjoyed all the other games within this genre or this series, but also because my beloved little fur babies, Michael and Socks, are both featured in this game. Which is just amazing in my opinion and I want to give a big thanks to the developer you are awesome for including my pets and for making such awesome games. So I'm going, oh, there's speech? Quite that puppy up. I don't, don't want to turn the music all the way down, but I don't want it blaring like it is. I think that'll work. Meow meow. Okay, we want to turn that. Out there. Meow meow. Meow meow. Meow meow. Okay. So that should be good. The speech bubbles. Apparently we can customize those. I'm gonna stick with the one that's here already. Alright. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this. Now if I seem a little tired, it's because I have had two rounds of family reunion in a single weekend, and so I'm kind of recuperating from that. Okay, Sosig, you dragged me out of the house for what exactly? Meow, meow, meow. Because you were so busy, Chook. I might enjoy some time at home without you and Cow. You'd get bored. You'll have much nicer time here haunting the pub with friends. Also, you even out of the number for you even out the number for us mortally challenged. These two are my best friends. Chook's a ghost, but doesn't stop her from doing most things. Cow, on the other hand, is a proud member of the Living Dead. We never did find out what happened to his body. Yeah. Less maintenance this way. <laughs> what is this game anyway? It's a role-playing game. We pretend to be pirates and stuff. That sounds <laughs> fun. And all other things in between. <clears throat> I've sat next to you to keep an eye on you. I've been sat next to you to keep an eye on you. <laughs> I thought we were friends, Min. The orange one over there is Hebel. Me <laughs> me. He's a small whirlwind of chaotic enthusiasm. He needs somewhere to direct all the energy. All that energy currently. <laughs> Are you doing a running commentary for any spirits out there tonight? Yeah, seem polite to keep him filled in. <laughs> That's Min, by the way. She's head of the Psychic Association on the island. The only psychic. <laughs> This is going to run like a well-oiled machine. Aye! If I even smell you trying to get dinosaurs involved, Hebel, I will make your time a misery. There's, there's a pirate theme to this game, and it's going to be respected. Last but not least, in the middle, that's Exley. Another undead. He runs the pub, the Cheeky Unicorn. He keeps Hebel out of trouble, employing him behind the bar. <laughs> if I could hire anyone else, I would. <laughs> you love me. <laughs> well, I weather you like a storm. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get started, shall we? <laughs> what? I'm not even sure how to play. It's real easy. Come talk with our characters when you start. <laughs> I spent hours writing this, so it's going to be taken seriously. Heh <laughs> So according to the email from the developer, my cats are in the Viking area as a couple of totem poles. Michael, did you find a box? Huh? Oh, come here, kitty kitty. Michael, come here. Come say hi. Come on. Michael, come here. Kitty kitty kitty. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. I hear one of the others. Come here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Come here. Socks, who's a pretty girl? Come here. Come here, Socks. Come here, princess. Okay, 
fine, ignore me. Oh, this looks real nice. I could certainly get used to this. <laughs> I love the spaghetti cat. Cape card napa. Uh, Min. Don't you look nice? Ship in a bottle. It's a ship in a bottle. I have no idea how they get those ships in there. Such a mystery. It takes hours of concentration. Captain Min! Hiya! What are you up to? What is your character? What are you up to? What are you up to? Well, not much. Currently, I'm stuck here. <laughs> Which means you're stuck here too, by the way. Huh? How come? My ship is the only way off this island currently. But my character's superstitious nature keeps getting in the way. That fountain over there you noticed isn't running. And there's an old wives' tale that a fountain if the fountain is not running, any ship leaving the port will sink. What's your character? I'm glad you asked. I am a mighty pirate queen. Meow, meow, meow. Nice. I'm rough, tough, and ever so slightly superstitious. I've got my sights set on a rumor on rumors of haunted treasure. Or trying to track down the sea goddess. Can I join your crew? So can I join your crew? Well, it's yes and no, really. What do you mean? You can join my crew if you get the fountain going again. <laughs> A ship can't sail if the fountain is all dried up. It's just not right. So I just need to get the fountain started. <laughs> Easy! We can do that. Good, because I really want to use my ship. <laughs> you can escape with me if you help my character out. <laughs> can I come too? Not a chance. <laughs> this is so much fun. Do you know why the fountain stops? Sea goddess, haunted treasure, and laters. And my cat found a bug. Do you know why the fountain stopped? I suspect Hebel had something to do with it. <laughs> he sat right next to it. He's got an overactive mouth and overactive limbs. <laughs> He's our little amber whirlwind. <laughs> He's a gremlin, is what he is. Anything he touches breaks or caves in on itself. <laughs> See, got us? Yes, if you discover her palace, you can grant any wish granted. <laughs> I've heard some have found her palace. I am going to try and track her down. I imagine having any wish granted. <laughs> I keep thinking I've decided what I might ask for. Then boom, I think of something else. Haunted treasure. Some male has been going out with a flyer for haunted treasure attraction. <laughs> I think the word haunted is tearing a lot of people. Ghosts don't bother me. <laughs> me either. Ghost proof. That's us. Laters. Laters, men. There's a birdo. What's this? Rum barrels. This stuff is extremely volatile. There's a cork firmly sealing it up. What's that? Chalk picture. Looks like a chalk drawing. Okay. So where's this fountain? It's a bird. Hey, so sick. Come here. Why are you whispering? Why are you whispering? Shh, not so loud. We can't let Exley hear us. Oh no, what did you do? Okay, so I might have looked at his notes. Just a peek. So scandalous. So if you want any little hints and tips, come talk to me. Also, if you need a small amount of help, just give the space bar a tap and I'll show you things you can interact with. Stop, cheat. Stop cheating. That's just so easy. I can see what Exley's writing. 
all the things he has planned for you. Careful or he'll notice though. I'll be careful. I'm always careful. Yeah, that's how you ended up dead. By being ever so careful. You know, it's funny. You can't play anything without cheating, can you? Hey, I'm just leaving the option there. It's up to you if you decide to use it or not. Didn't know you were playing too. I didn't know you were playing too. I'm sort of playing. I'm a retired pirate. Seeing as I'm retired, I just want to sit right here. Watching the world go by. Passing judgment on everyone. You decided to play as a ghost, too. I've got a very limited imagination. I like to draw on personal experience. Fair enough. Thanks for letting me know. Shh, keep it down. Remember, come back to me for hints and hit the space bar to see interactive spots. I don't even know what a space bar is. Don't worry about it, someone might. Um, nice hat. Nice hat. Thanks. Yours looks pretty. S is looking pretty sweet too. Ah, thanks. Not quite sure about the eye patch though. A bit rugged. Yeah, I think it suggests a violent lifestyle. Don't worry, you aren't that intimidating. Meow meow. meow. Till later, too. See ya. All right. So fountain. It's the fountain. Doesn't seem to be working though. Meow meow. Okay, let's see here. Hmm. Okay, what kind of system is this? Okay, so. <coughs> hey, Sosig! Hey, Hubble. <sighs> Have you been messing with the fountain? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> I fell in it. A little earlier. Thought I saw some cash in there. I've never seen a fountain without cash in it. <laughs> Exley has to come up with the worst fictional fountain ever! <laughs> did you stop the fountain from running? Huh? No, that wasn't me. Cow did that. <laughs> he came out of his shop and messed about with the panel on the side. <laughs> Seemed awfully pleased with himself. Cow turned off the fountain? <laughs> I know! I'm shocked too! <clears throat> you know what annoyed me the most? I didn't see how he got there. I always wondered how he does that. Wonder if it's one of those things which can only happen when you aren't looking. Like you do cleaning? Exactly like that! So what are you up to? Fortune telling. Nice. <laughs> I'm struggling a bit though. Min makes it look so easy. It's not really something you can teach, Hebel. Also, you made that character you wrote down that they can do really sick arts and crafts. This character's a bit of an artist at heart. <laughs> Just like me. I look forward to seeing this. Hey, babe, can you turn that down a bit? Me, me. Uh, are you using the crystal ball? I'm not having much luck with that, really. <laughs> I'm trying a couple of different methods currently. Just turn down the TV a bit! Crystal ball! Is the crystal ball switched on? Is the crystal ball switched on? Are you joking? Are there really switches on these things? Not sure. Never used one! Hmm. I'll keep at it. Might try dropping it from great heights. If that doesn't work... It'll sure make me feel better. Glad to hear you found something you enjoy. Things impacting with concrete really does fill me with joy. No, shooting canvases with paintballs would fill me with joy. If the canvas didn't rip. Later. <laughs> so let's go talk to Cow. Moo. <laughs> Fishbowl. 
cat picture. This is a horrible picture. I feel like its eyes follow me around the room. <laughs> Man, there's so much stuff to look at. This is a pretty nice plant pot. Meow, meow. It's got flamingos on it. Meow, meow, meow. Bulletin board for local meow, meow. news. Looks like Hebel is hard at work hustling. Meow, meow. It's a box covered in stars. Meow, meow, meow. With some junk in the bottom. More candles. It's some wax candles. Well, let's talk to Cow. Hey, Cow. Hey, check it out. I got a shop. I'm my own boss. So am I. Nice place. Do you know anything? Yeah, let's see. Do you know anything about the fountain outside? Yeah, I turned it off. Why'd you do that? I'm a savvy businessman, so see. If folks arrive and no one can leave, everyone has to buy from me. Don't even like customers. That's very true. Although, if I'm the only shop, I control the whole market. I can skyrocket all my prices. Then I only have to make one sale a month to stay afloat. <sighs> um... Nice place. Thanks. Always wanted a shop. I can just fill it with all the things I like. Disguise my hoarding as a business. <laughs> so customer service is like a secret passenger, passenger, passion of yours? Whoa, hey now. I never said I wanted customers. I've been learning some techniques for dealing with the unfortunate consequences. My favorite phrase, sorry, but that's not for sale. Randomly bursting into tears to make people awkwardly leave. And my favorite, we're closing in five minutes. Oh, that last one gives me the chills. I love it. We're closing in five minutes. Oh, yes. I feel like you picked up a lot from Hebel. Hebel taught me everything I know about customer service. It really helps me connect with the character. I'm really getting into the role here. It's really convincing. <laughs> I'm so proud of you right now. Oh, just a night in the basement with some friends. <sighs> ah, choking myself with my own freaky microphone while I desperately try to get my sock off. Ugh, I've been on my feet all day, so these socks reek. Not you, socks. The ones on my feet. You smell fine. You can stop licking yourself. You're clean. You lick yourself anymore and you're gonna be a naked cat. Yeah. No fur. <laughs> She's just off in a corner. She started licking herself when I told her no fur. She just kind of looked at me like, what? <laughs> um, can you turn the fountain? Do you think you can turn the fountain back on? I don't like the sound of that. Why? I would have to work. Be polite. I don't think I can handle that. I'm not sure if it's such a good idea. Why? So, there's a ton of kids outside. Think of all the browsing. Think of all the noise. I saw a cruise ship arriving. <coughs> saw a cruise ship arriving. <coughs> what? No. Yes. Such a cute little gift shop. <coughs> they soon descend on this place like seagulls on trash. <coughs> Picking up things and touching everything. Maybe drop a few things, too. Hey, wait. The beer can't support a cruise ship. You're lying. Men's ship is the biggest thing that can it's support. Damn. Think of all the browsing. Just endless browsing and questions. Think of the questions. Do you have this in another color? Can you gift wrap this? Do you have any more in the back? That's why I got my assistant. Clive handles all the annoying questions. This is a f this fish. Yeah, Clive. Think of all the noise. This place is mostly wooden. Footsteps in here are going to be so loud you won't be able to think. 
That's no problem. I've got some real cute earmuffs under the desk that look pretty great in them. Meow, meow. There's a ton of kid out meow, kids meow. outside. Really grubby hands. I think they've been eating. What were they eating? Um, <laughs> something really meow. messy. Can you wait? Oh yeah. There's just a heap of super greasy kids meow, outside. Meow. I heard them say they love to handle meow, everything. Meow. Licking fingers and just running them over products. They wouldn't do that to my products. Oh, they would. And they will. Unless you give me that code. Yeah. Fine, fine. I left a note under that flamingo plant meow, pot. Meow, meow. Thank you. Don't let them in. <laughs> hey, you aren't supposed to crumble so easily. Yeah. So sick is also awfully persuasive. Look at that big daft face. Yeah. I can't say no. Aw, oh, thanks, cow. All good, buddy. <laughs> oh, it's like Michael when he's begging for a chicken nugget from me. He just gives me this pitiful look. There's a note under the plant pot. Note to self. It's in. Me hmm. Okay. So it's in the tiny bottle. Sorry. I have been outside all day. There's a note in here, too. Looks like Chook has something. Okay, so we're on a treasure hunt. Hey, so... Honey, hands for me. Sure do. Thanks for that. Felt like I had something crawling on the... My arm. Have you seen a note from Cow at all? Yeah, I ha have it, actually. It wanted me to remind him later, and I had this. This looks cryptid to me. Alright. So. Something here. Be gentle. So it's an eyeball. Alright, there's one. So it's an eye. A uh, skull. My least favorite thing to draw a dagger. Really good my stupid pen is being an idiot. That looks like a carrot! Alright. So let's see here. Ugh, this is the worst. Alright, so... I... Fish... Skull... Dagger. Nice! All right, let's go talk to Min. Hiya. Fountain's fixed. Nice. I see. See, I knew you could do it. Let's bo get aboard. Get on board and get out of here. So, ooh, wow, cool ship. Hey, thanks. Is this really the whole map, though? Min's character mishandled the map earlier. You'll have to track down a map of the wider area. Min let me hold the map. <coughs> Look how well that turned out. Pirate maps are delicate things. Hubble doesn't really do delicate. Those gremlin hands. So... Well, that's an interesting thing. Ooh, it's a dragon. Sea shrine. Woo! A large stone door. There has to be a way to open it. Worn out crumbling wall. Little stone dragon still guarding it though. It's doing a good job with what's left. Okay, so I might have to come back. Wait, nope. The dragon's legs just moved. No longer does anything. Okay.
Hey, hey, success. That was just from guessing. Ooh. Meow, meow, meow. Much better. And what is in here, I wonder? Switch. Convenient light switch. There's cow again. Really? Nice. Got a little Dungeons and Dragony in here. Meow, meow. Boxes and boxes of goddess water. It makes bold claims about health benefits. The ability to travel through time. The ability to time travel being one of them. Followed. My mom tried to call me. I don't hear my phone go off. Sorry guys. Followed by a mass of side effects in tiny text. They ran out of room on the label for them. Hey, cow! Yeah. Hey, check it out! I joined a cult. <laughs> meow, meow. Um, it's not so bad. Uh, what is this cult? Blessed water sales. I got a whale song CD for joining. Meow, meow, meow. Ah, cute. I am my own boss. boss. I can sell holy water and work on my poems at the same time now. Poems are my passion. Yeah. I've been told they're super calming. Great for putting people to sleep. Where's everyone else? Where's everyone else? Well, they said they were heading out to the shops. That was three weeks ago. <laughs> Do you think they might have quit? Not sure. I read them one of my poems. They all calmed right down. Yeah. Much less aggressive about meeting sale targets. Did they seem happier? They actually did. They did actually. Can I join this cult? Wait, what? You actually want to sign up? Really? I mean, that's fantastic. I ran out of whale sadies, I'm afraid, but I've got this instead. It's a vouch for a free prize. Mm -hmm. Wow, thanks. You'll need to redeem it at the general store. <sighs> Can't wait to teach you all the benefits of goddess water. Anything else? Is there anything else you can tell me about your cult? Goddess water is a lifestyle, not a product. It's all about sales and living the dream. Yeah. Oh my back. <sighs> we are all our own bosses and set our own hours. Sold everything I had, but it was worth it. Really close to reaching diamond level. What's diamond level? I don't know, but it's diamond. It has to be important. I think you got swindled. Later, cow. Come back soon. Meow, meow. Statue of the sea goddess. Or what she's supposed to look like. She's an icon. Okay, so... More and more boxes. I wonder what Kyle's going for this. I'm going to get rich! Goddess is a the goddess is a symbol for all hard-working go-getters like me. When do you become rich? Any day now. I can feel it! Okay. So this does seem like it is a full... Fuller game. Um... I'm probably going to have to stop here in a bit because I'm feeling like crap right now and it's already 6.03. Um, I'm just going to check out all the... Actually, let's go check out what our free gifts are. Ooh. Because I've got a friend coming over here in a bit. Alright, so let's go into here and see what this free prize is. Which is cow. Hey, cow. 
Um, catch you later. Yeah. Meow meow. What's this voucher for? Oh, that's a ticket for a free item from the Buy Box yeah. of Wonders. Take anything you want from the box down below. Nice. Meow meow meow. Let's see what's in here. Hmm, looks like a piece of sandpaper. It's the only useful thing here. Enjoy your item. Don't forget. Alright, everybody. So that's all the time I have for this episode, sadly. I'm super, super impressed with how this game is so far. I cannot wait to play more of it. Seeing as though this is a fuller game, I am going to be playing this in parts. And I cannot wait to play more and find my little fuzzies in the game. Um... So if you guys like the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you have not already, be sure to give that notification bell a high five so you be notified every single time we upload a new video. If you would like to try this game for yourself, the link will be in the description below. I highly recommend you get it. Um, it's going to be $9.99 by the 24th. Right now it's like $8.99, so like a dollar less but I highly recommend that you guys check out this person's games support the developer they are awesome and I'll see you guys in the next video bye